Hi everybody, my name is Randy George. I have an ostomy and I'd like to tell you about myself for National Ostomy Month. So I've had my bag for a couple years. In 2021 I was diagnosed with cancer, started my treatment, chemo, radiation. It did not work. By December of 2021 I was in the hospital and they were removing all my lower GI and giving me a colostomy bag. A little bit about myself personally is by trade, I'm a personal trainer. I got into it, um, one, because I do like working with people and helping people, but also I love exercising, as I love it for the mental health aspect. Honestly, I feel so good. When I knew I was going to have my surgery for an ostomy, I was very concerned, and I definitely, my mental health sunk. I was grieving for what was going to happen, and I really started getting into depression. I was worried I wasn't going to be able to exercise ever again. I had my surgery and it was a little some complications. The ostomy was fine, my wound wasn't healing. So I spent some time in the hospital, more, more than normal. It was, didn't work, I didn't really move for a long time, about four months. On Instagram I came across a profile of this guy in the UK. He has a bag, I believe from an ileostomy, it's permanent. He was lifting a lot of weight, he was deadlifting like 500 pounds. And seeing that really gave me a lot of hope and I was very determined, I'm like, I'm going to find a way to do this gotten my really heavy lifts back up to where they were and actually my bench press has actually surpassed where I was you know before my ostomy surgery so I spent a lot of time strengthening my core and helping others do that it's been really successful just because you have the ostomy bag does not mean that you are limited I mean you do have to be careful and you have to be a little more strategic maybe than you would before the bag there's nothing that you can't do. There's no restrictions on moving your body. There's a right way and a wrong way to, to do everything. And you have to apply, you have to be smart with how you do things with an ostomy. But between, you know, belts and certain exercises and movements and breathing, you can safely do things. You can do any activities you want. I hope that you can find some inspiration in that and know that there's nothing limiting you. If there's something that you want to do, there's a way to do it. And the bag should not be holding you back.